Christmas tree train is coming, bringing trees for all the kids. Oh, the little comfort belly shakes a lot like jelly. See the smoke come from the stack as the chug chug chugs along the track to bring the trees, Christmas trees. My mountains are beautiful this time of year. The late autumn breeze piles up the leaves. The first patches of snow are on the ground. And the happy whistle of the Christmas tree train reminds me that Christmas is coming. You say you never heard of the Christmas tree train? Well, <laughs> my forest is where all the best Christmas trees are grown, you see. And that old train brings the lumberjacks who cut the trees that wind up in your living rooms each Christmas. <laughs> well, you didn't think they grew in the city, now did you? I never rode on that old rattler, but a couple of my friends did just last year about this time. And, well, that turned out to be some train ride, let me tell you. But on second thought, let them tell you. It's their story. That little bear cub is Buttons. Hey, Buttons, wait till you see what the ranger's doing. And that's his little pal, Rusty. Oh, and the ranger? Yeah, that's me, Ranger Jones. But most folks just call me Jonesy. Is he leaving on that train, Rusty? No, and I'm not going to tell you. You've got to see it to believe it. Mmm, smells like winter is here. Oh, lots of snow on the ridge, Bridget. Mama, can I go over to the ranger's cabin with Rusty? Well, all right, but stay away from the railroad tracks. And Rusty, I'm serving supper in 30 minutes. Gee, thanks, Mom. We won't be long. <sighs> oh, excuse me, Rosie. I guess it's getting close to hibernation time. <laughs> Sounds like Abner's hibernating already. <laughs> Terrific. I've got a whole winter of that buzz saw to look forward to. Bridget, you've got to do something about Abner's snoring. Now, George, nobody complains when you snore. Yeah, well, I don't snore for three months like he does. <laughs> Abner, wake up. It's time to go to bed. <clears throat> oh, oh, oh. oh, gosh. Is it spring already? <laughs> See, Buttons? Isn't that nifty? Well, if it isn't Buttons, I'd have thought you'd be sleeping by now. Gee, Willikers, what are all the lights for, Mr. Jones? Yeah, I thought the lights were just for the inside of a cabin. Those are Christmas lights. I always put them up this time of year so Santa Claus can find me. Who is Sandy Claus? Yeah. Sounds like a bear with dirty nails. <laughs> Santa Claus is a jolly little man who lives at the North Pole. And he brings people presents once every year, you see. Presents? What are presents? Come on inside and I'll show you. These are a few Christmas presents I bought for my grandchildren. A rocking horse for Jeffrey. Gosh! And for Jennifer, an old-fashioned jack-in-the-box. Here, push the red button. <laughs> hey, don't be scared. It's only a toy. Buttons? Rusty? I didn't mean to scare you. Buttons! Rusty! Come back, guys! Phew. Is that thing following us? I don't think so. We better get started for home. Let's go. No, wait. I'm too tired to move right now. On second thought, let's run for it. My feet won't move. Oh, where are those children? Oh, I just hope they're smart enough to stay at the ranger's cabin till the storm blows over. <laughs> oh, knock it off, Abner. That was 
pretty stupid? Me running into a garbage can. Well, that was a stupid place to leave a garbage can. Children are missing. Abner, they're somewhere out in that storm. Don't worry, ladies. George and I'll find them. Uh, they were headed for the ranger's cabin. I wonder if they ever got there. Well, I guess I'm too late for supper. How can you think of food at a time like this? It helps keep my mind off of being lost. Just one more tree that I'm heading for the barn, Jack. Must be a farmer. Come on! <laughs> Yippee! He'll know the way to the ranger's cabin. Phew! I thought we were goners there for a minute. <laughs> yeah, what was that noisy thing? Uh-oh! We're moving! This whole bunch of trees is moving. Keep her coming, Jack! That way! That man is moving the tree! Wow! What a strong guy! Okay, Jack! Put him in number 10! That's your last load! Okay! Take her away! Rusty, I think we've been locked in a cage. And the cage is moving. They're taking us away somewhere. Maybe to one of those zoo places. President will be throwing the switch on our national Christmas tree, and isn't that beautiful? Coming! <sighs> Who on earth could that be at this hour? Ranger, it's George and Abner. <sighs> well, hi, fellas. Uh, come on in. I guess the children told you about their Christmas decorations. So they were here. Well, yeah. Y you mean they didn't? <sighs> well, they didn't come home, Jonesy. Did they say anything about where they were going? No, they just ran off sudden like. You see, I was showing them this jack in the box. Come and... on, Jonesy, we gotta find those kids before they get lost. What about Abner? I'm afraid he's just gonna hibernate on your couch. Rusty, I don't mind telling you. I'm scared. Don't worry, Buttons. Remember, I'm a fox. We're supposed to be pretty smart about getting out of messes like this. Ooh. What, what, what was that? <laughs> Somebody said who. Who's that? Who said that who? <laughs> That's me. That's who. An owl. How did you get in here? I thought I was flying into a barn, but it turned out to be a boxcar. <laughs> I thought we were in a cave. Yeah, what's a, a boxcar? <laughs> it's just a big box on wheels. Every freight train pulls boxcars. Pulls them where? Well, being as how this one's full of Christmas trees, I figure we're heading for the big city. Gosh, I never thought I'd get to the big city. What's it like there? Take it from me, kids. It's a real jungle. The big city's a crazy forest of buildings and cars and people. Heck, we ought to be right at home in a forest. Speaking of home... No, Jonesy, those children know better than to tip over a litter can. Well, two small animals ran this way and... Uh-oh. Looky here. Those are fox prints running down the slope. They're Rusty's paw prints, all right, but what happened to Buttons? Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Sheepers, he must have been running awful fast. It's a big train coming <laughs> you know, for two wild animals, you two sure scare easy. That's amazing! That train went right through us! Buttons! Rusty! They wouldn't have taken the train, would they? Hmm, it's just possible. Come on, 
Let's get to a telephone. And they scream and holler at each other and push and shove. So whatever you do, stay away from humans, especially the ones driving automobiles. Gee, and they call us wild animals. Switch in yard. What? I can hardly hear you. Has the Christmas tree train pulled in yet? Should be arriving any minute. If you find a couple of stowaways... What? Throwaways? Speak up. A bear and a fox? Are you serious? Oh, just little cubs. <laughs> okay, Ranger, I'll be on the lookout for them. Now remember, you two. The minute they open the door, you follow me. Okay, but how are you going to know which train is going back home? See that train way over there? Its engine is pointing in the direction we want to go. Uh-oh, here comes somebody. Shh, get back and get ready. Charlie, you check number nine. I'll take the others. jungle out there. There aren't even any trees. Goodbye, Mr. Owl. Gee, Buttons, I wonder if we'll ever find our way back home. Rusty, what do we do now? Well, those men won't let us near the trains. We'll just have to walk home. That looks like the only trail. Let's get going. Did you ever see such tall cabins? Jeepers. Maybe, if we could find him, he'd tell us how to get home. Hey, that man kind of looks like Jonesy. I'll bet he knows the way to our forest. Say, mister, could you... <laughs> that was a close one. Thanks, Rusty. I... I guess city people don't like rivers. Hiding it away like this. Maybe they don't know it's down here. Ooh, this place gives me the creeps. Let's get out of here. People sure are very friendly. I'm getting awful hungry, Rusty. <coughs> Do you think they'd mind if we joined them for breakfast? Come on, maybe they can tell us how to get home. Hi, would you mind if we... <coughs> Where, where do you think we are? That was a train, I think. How come city people hide everything underground? I guess they don't like trains either. Uh. We're gonna be squashed! Jump! Buttons, say something! Boy, I sure am hungry. We gotta get out of here. get the feeling we're not very welcome here. I wish we had that sign with us. The one Jonesy put up in the park? Yeah. Be kind to animals. Yeah! I don't see any people, Buttons. Let's make a run for it. Run for what? 
All we've been doing is run, run, run. And I haven't seen any way out of this crazy place. Well, we can't just sit here for goodness sake. We gotta keep looking for a trail back home. Well, what is it this time? It's a man with a big knife. Rusty, there's no place to run. Why don't they label these dumb boxes? How am I supposed to know which department they go to? Ready? Here's those stuffed animals for the toy department. Good. I've been looking all over for them. Hey, give me a hand with this load of catch you wear. <sighs> hey, that little bear looks like you. Watch yourselves up there. Lie real still. Maybe they'll think we're stuffed. <laughs> now, is that any way to treat expensive toys, Barney? Man, this teddy bear looks almost real. <laughs> My, aren't you a cute little thing? <laughs> Look at this one, Gramps. How about those eyes? <laughs> you saved me a half a dozen of each of those, Barney. They're going to be a big hit with some of my customers. Poor old guy. He acts like he believes he's really Santa Claus. Alice, make room in the zoo. Don't tell me you found the teddy bears. Yep, just for that, I'll let you buy me coffee. They're being put in the zoo. Well, at least they feed you in the zoo. Boy, am I hungry. <gasps> Barney, would you look at this darling teddy bear? <laughs> I knew you'd flip when you saw him. <gasps> and this adorable fox. Gee, what a nifty toy. Can I hold that funny little fat one? I want to play with him. Well, I'll let you hold one for a minute, but be very careful. <laughs> oh, Barney, that's a real bear. Holy cow, and a real fox. Hey, stop those wild animals. Let's check the cafeteria. Animals can't resist food. Did you hear that, Buttons? Food. Oh, boy. <laughs> Those little devils. Pardon me, but have you seen a little bear and a little fox in here? Uh, no. Gertrude, someone's taken our lunch. Rusty? Yeah? Are we dreaming or are we back home? It's a tiny forest. But look at all the toys! Well, <sighs> now that we've had supper, I better curl up here and... <sighs> Hold it. Now don't you start hibernating. Buttons? Buttons? Oh, no. I'm gonna dim the lights and win a wonderland if you're throwing there. Okay, Harry. Wow. Well, at least that gives us a little hope. Thanks for calling. The station master tried to stop them when they ran out of the Christmas tree train. Surely somebody will find them and... Oh, dear. They're there, Bridget. If I wasn't on duty, I'd go down there and look for them. <laughs> Sir boss, I think this is the prettiest one we've done in years. Gee, I'm kind of nervous. There's a whole lot of people counting on us to win first prize this year. Well, good luck, boss. Shall I turn them on now? Hit it, Harry. It's a great surprise when you open up your eyes and the dreams that you dream appear. It's snowing. It's snowing. Little flakes of white all around just to bring good cheer. It's snowing, it's snowing. Winter time's here. We're safe from the storm. Here inside it's nice and warm. The fireplace is burning bright. We'll all dance. 
dance around Cause there's snow upon the ground A wonderful delight That happened overnight The trees are bending low With the weight of fallen snow It's a miracle that comes each year It's snowing It's snowing Winter time's And it looks like Stacy's department store has come up with a real winner this year. We don't know who on earth made those incredibly lifelike animal toys, but... Rosie, George, look! It's snowing. It's the children! Where are they? What is that place? It's a store in the city. Say, I think I know a man who works there this time of year. Winter time's here. Who? Ranger Jones? Oh, Jonesy. Well, my, my, it's been a long time. Uh, what? The window? Really? I bet those whiskers are fake. They're real? Well, I thought they were different when they were delivered. I knew they were fake whiskers. <laughs> sure thing, Jonesy. Happy to help you out. Have a Merry Christmas! A miracle that comes each year It's snowing It's snowing Buttons? Rusty? Oh, come on! I'm going to take you home! Oh, 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 my goodness! Well, my little furry friends, it's a bit early for this trick. But this is a special delivery, huh? <laughs> now, don't be afraid. This is going to be fun. <laughs> ho, ho, ho! And up we go! We've got a little practice run to make, gang. <laughs> I'm a little rusty after 12 months. In 12 months, you'll be a big rusty. Not bad for a bear. On Donner! On Blitzen! Jonesy, I appreciate what you're trying to do for us, but this Sandy Claus guy, I don't know. Hush, George, we have to believe in him. Wake up, Abner. That's what I call a real friend. Buttons. Rusty. Abner, wake up, Abner. Huh? What's going on? Is it... Spring. No, it's Merry Christmas. A little bit early. Ho, ho, ho. Uh, I must be dreaming. And a happy New Year. The Christmas tree train is coming, bringing trees for all the kids. Now the train's high falling with the trees. It's all and see the smoke. Come from the stack as the chug chug chugs along the track. Hear the whistle blowing loud and clear. Telling everyone the Christmas tree train 